I assume, to start. That once... May I ask a favor of you? I never I am I wonder I hope you've had a chance to meet everyone. Do I have to say yes? So you I never I am the I wonder I hope you've had a chance to meet everyone. So I never I am I wonder if you, I hope you've had a chance to meet Sure. Hubert, you may Pardon me. Uh yes, we can't I can't quite uh Well, I, I'm, I'm I getting. Am. Have you met the folks? Yeah. So are we? The game's like over there. No, they're like, well, okay, now we're back. The game's, all, the game's good, but we're all quiet. All right, so I lowered the game a lot, and I upped me a lot, and I up. Hi. Hi. Discord's still quiet. Huh. No. There we go. Uh, turn it on the chamber. Uh, yes. Sure. Probably not because then they're, they're probably then using combo shit, not actual like choose what skills and combine them. Hmm. Uh, yeah. So this is going to be weird because I do know how I'm going to do this, but I also don't know how I'm going to do this. If that makes any sense. Okay, shut the fuck up, Ray. No one cares. It's going to be like semi speed runny, but not at all speed runny. It's going to be me blasting through the story, but figuring out how to actually overcome everything else. It's, it's just challenge playthrough. Yeah, it's a challenge playthrough in it. Yeah. Fully by itself, like actual speedrun, speedrun. No, normal. Normal run, uh, usually around ninety hours. Jesus Christ, well, have fun. Seventy. Yeah, well, I'm not gonna do this all in one. Uh, in fact, it's probably gonna take me more than ninety hours collectively, because ninety hours is assuming that you're not skipping through any of the story, but. Because I'm doing such a hard challenge, I'm going to be prepping at every corner and trying to uh, do things. And there may be points where I legitimately just soft lock myself because I didn't prep, prep, pre prepare correctly. And I'm also doing a challenge that I have no idea if it's actually possible. What? This. Oh, I thought you meant like an extra challenge. Well, it is an extra challenge. Maddening mode is, is possible, but... Um, I don't know if it's possible with just using Claude. I've seen it done with just Byleth, but I have never seen it with just Claude. Well, you know, Professor, Professor, I've got a small favor to ask. Yeah. Byleth is right here. <laughs> this is Byleth. Streamer, Streamer chat. He's, he's streaming right now. Mm hmm. Like bad talk. 
I don't know. Uh, and then I might have to do certain paralogs, which might be weird. Because I'm not doing this uh, on New Game Plus. This is New Game completely. So I don't have any of the weird cheats that you saw me using in the beginning. Gallant. Oh, so it's going to be just base? Base, yep. Okay. Which is going to be fucking horrible. Uh, because it means I can't uh, buff out Claude's... Uh, Ranks, yeah, and which means that I won't have counter attack for a while. Yeah. The raccoon. Oh, uh, it's a cat. Well, well, there's cats and dogs in this. Oh, also professor level up things, which... Ooh, yeah. Oh, God, I'm gonna hate this. Okay, so... Uh, not... Yeah, I'm gonna have to do a lot of micromanaging because... Or not a lot of micromanaging, but yeah, side quests because... Uh, uh, what's it called? Side quests will give me the ability to get higher professor rank, which allows me to do more things in free time. Uh, because right now I can only do one action in free time. Uh, and I already use that on dining with uh, two people. Uh, I mean, that's basically this game. Uh, and I, oh shit, I'm actually gonna have to talk to people a lot. Uh, because I want to get supports up so that I can recruit a lot of people, which means I can open up more paralogs, which allows me to get more items. Ooh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, I think this is going to take at least 120 hours, I'll be honest. At least. Uh, uh, probably. No, okay, I said the wrong thing. Caspar. Yes, those are those are my those are my coins. Post that front bot. Oh Rooney! Oh I think I have eight thousand. Oh yeah, you should. Because I gave you Bruh streamer. Oh. Oh, that's for Smash. So basically, if I was streaming Elite Smash Grind and you were like, hey, I want to fight you, you could say that. And then you would be able to play, you know. Oh, God, I'm going to really have to talk to everybody. Oh, shit. Deep mood. Okay. Ferdinand's birthday. Five. Oh, God. Imagine being a streamer, yeah. Alright, let's see how this goes. This will be the ultimate gauge of if I'm gonna continue to do this right now or if I'm gonna do more research. Alright, ten minute playthrough easy. Basically. Uh I'm gonna try my fucking damnedest. Uh so this, this first battle is gonna be like two tries, three? Uh ten probably. Ten tries? I'm gonna give it ten tries and if I can't eight. You're gonna say eight I can do it in eight? Yeah. No way. There's no fucking way. Uh, cause, okay, to put it in perspective, uh, sharks, what I'm doing, you see all of these units that I have right here? Eight. 
Smitten. He's just saying it. I don't understand what he's trying uh, to say. Okay, is that a character from Smith? Say five? What the fuck is wrong with you people? Do you not understand? I don't think you guys truly understand what is gonna happen. <laughs> One difficulty, one one character, but I have to keep one other character deployed, which means that I'm going to strip them of all of their ways to a counterattack, which means I'm going to be having to protect them while doing this. I'm playing king of the ca castle, essentially. Essentially, I'm going to be having to constantly do two objectives uh, with one unit. Uh, they can use healing items. Like, basically, the only limitation, or the the only thing they can't do is counterattack. They can interact with the environment around them, i.e. opening chests or stuff like that. But is there any item to revive? So, like, let's say Cla Claude dies. No, there is no... If either one of my... If either Byleth or Claude goes down at any point during the battle, it's an automatic restart. Um, eight tries. This is fuck. You're gonna see how this is gonna go. <laughs> Claude is a, uh, is a ranger class, so he's already squishy. He's already squishy. I'm gonna use uh, axes with him as well because I want to eventually get him to brigand class, which allows him to get death blow, like I was talking about before. Yeah. Um, so I'm gonna buff him out by using. He's gonna have the ability to use both, basically. Um, so that means I'm gonna give him an iron axe. Give me that. And then I'm gonna fucking buff you with, uh, every single other vulnerary I have. Uh, vulnerary. Those are healing items. They heal 10 HP each, so I have 12, 120 healing, but it takes a turn in battle to use them. So basically, you can heal and then just get fucked again. Yes. If I can think, if I think that I can, um, what's it called, uh, handle it, per se, if I can, like, have a moment of reprive, then I'll use my healing, and that's why I'm giving it to everybody. Do I have any? <sighs> oh, I might... Oh, I can't set a Justin's yet. Fuck, dude. Oh, I hate this. No bat, no battalions. Oh, no. All right. Well, let's do this. Uh, fuck you, Gerald. Um... Uh, level one. Oh no. Oh, shit. oh, this is not gonna go well. This is not gonna go well at all. Oh, uh, that's danger area. So, all of the purple area is everywhere I cannot go without being attacked. Uh, so. Typically, the strategy is to only aggro one. So, like, you see how this guy only has the red outline, but this guy has the purple outline up here, which means that because I have a ranged unit, I want to put him there. And I'm going to put you in the fucking corner. I don't fucking care. I care a lot. Oh, but right, he blocks it, so he, I can't do that. Um, <sighs> no, he hasn't attacked yet. If I go here, yeah. He's an iron axe. I guess I could do this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 
boy. Um, I'm gonna straight up say this right now. Uh, this is impossible. No, this is impossible. This is le legitimately impossible. Look, I got a good hit on Ash. Woo! Then I gotta run away. See you later. I mean, okay, okay, now, yes, here's a question though. You hit one person, and then one person fucked you. Yeah. So basically, what I'm, what I'm seeing is that you'll have to take, you'll have to hit one, they're gonna hit you and fuck you, you're gonna heal, and then they're gonna hit you. Uh, two other characters are going to come by, hit you again, and then you're dead. Yes. So, I don't think maddening is the best option for this offense. I have to. No, you don't. No. Ow. Stop. I mean, I know I can do a normal run-through with... You know? Yes, for a fact. It's completely possible in a normal run with just one unit. Hard, I think it's possible... Uh, but it's a little bit harder as, as obvious. Maddening is where it really becomes a question because legitimately, like actually, I had used, okay, from up until that, that point to that point, I have used every opportunity I can to gain XP and I'm still only level one. Yes. Okay, well, then you get to do it fucked. Because getting quests is the best way to further myself. And. Wait. When you game over, when you hit somebody, right? They, you gain XP, right? So then that means. I gain one XP for hitting someone. Oh, okay, well, good though. Out of 100. And I gain like 15 ish for killing someone. So, I'm going to do something where I re-equip all of my units that would potentially be good here. And I am going to show you just how difficult through all of this, if I use all of my uh, abilities, how difficult it's going to be. So let's see, Iron Sword, Iron Board, Iron Axe, Iron Axe, Iron Gauntlets, okay. So that should be good enough. Um, I know doing this is possible, but it's gonna be difficult because it's on the hardest difficulty. Um, what's nice about this is that I can afford to let my units fall because it's a practice battle. Uh, normally in classic run, if a unit dies during battle, they automatically lose. Or that you automatically lose them for the entire game. Really? Yeah. Holy shit. Uh, you can do casual mode, which means that after each battle, they come back. But classic mode, the way that it's intended to be played, is they permadeath. Damn. So, I'm going to assume that I want to... Who is my highest defense? I'm gonna say you have my highest defense, right? Six, four, six, seven. But I also want you to attack first, so no. Stay focused. Screaming question, what's up? 
watching. Fuck you, Pubert. Finally leveled up! Woo! <laughs> I mean, theoretically, because it's just a bunch of 50-50s with Maddening Mode and Only Claude, I could eventually do it after getting the right answer. I'd be flipping a coin and hoping for it to land on heads every single fucking time. Which, Which is, a is a gigantic bra moment. See how easier that is with five other units? <laughs> yeah, no, this is just a demonstration for maddening mode is hard, but it's possible. Yeah. Using just one character. However, I really don't know if that's possible. Um, do I want to... Because you're going to get attacked anyway, so we'll just wait. Ow. Oh, no. Fuck you. Really? One... That's fucked up. Um, there was a 1% chance for him to do that. <laughs> That's how fucked up. Thank you. Uh, do I want to... What? Yeah, it's pretty fucked up, dude. I did it, but at what cost? Wow, if I focus down one unit with all of my guys, I can eventually take them down. Please don't hit me. Oh, okay. My favorite. Okay, there we go. Alright. So, my next question is, would I be able to do this with a new game plus? No, not duh. Duh, wait, why? Are they always going to be seven levels ahead of you? They're always going to be seven levels ahead of me, but by doing New Game Plus, I can get certain things that allow me to not necessarily be as strong in levels, but be stronger in other areas. Like taunting and shit. Yes, i.e. counterattack, having all of the skills available to me, 
um, going into different classes, um, stuff like that. So let's, how do I do this again? Try a new game plus. Yes. Moonies, yeah. All right, so we're gonna do file. I think it is. Yes, top two. Maddening. Classic. Yes. Alright. Because this is probably more doable. If only slightly more doable. Okay. Okay. Bye bye. I mean, sure, whatever, I'll just keep the name. I'm just gonna erase my file here. Let's just say, B. Okay. Hee hee hee, Luke.
Oh my god, want to become famous? Buy followers, holy shit. I'm gonna be famous. Sorry, the victory is mine. Ooh. All right, now let's see with all of my different ways of getting about things. Yes. It's been years since. Want to become famous? Buy followers. Yes. On bigfollows.com. I'm gonna be so famous, guys. I'm gonna be so famous. What the heck was that noise? <laughs> oh, hold on, I'll be back. Truly, <laughs> message. I just, I just realized that was. Oh. <laughs> uh, I, I, I had your uh, stream open, but I had it just tapped out because I was in game. Mm -hmm. So I looked over and I finally saw it. And I was like, oh, I shit. Um, that one okay. May I ask okay, you a Yeah. Yo, pro moderator? <laughs> P 
through mud? Guys, can we get a, a peggers in the chat, please? Yay, money. Shut up, Hannon. Golden deer, after all, you know, I was. Well, there, you know, Professor? Professor? I've got a small favor to ask.
count on you. Buy fucking shit yet. Oh, that sucks. I can't buy equipment a lot of it, so I kind of just gotta. Alright. So, with this, I should be able to. Okay, I'm gonna go back to place here. What can we get you? With this money, can't even buy a silver bow. That sucks. Uh, I guess training axe and If I really want to hit hard, question mark. Because I already have. Huh. I might want that later. We'll get with the training sword. With this, I should be able to buy the town. Oh. If this doesn't work reliably in my favor, I may just cut stream and um, do more research. Because I haven't done a whole lot of research. I've done some research. But knowing certain things rather than not will probably be a lot in my favor. Actually, yeah, I could probably do that, actually. Yeah, I can set adjustance, so that's nice. Let's see. Let's do Hilda and Scythia.
occasionally preventing counter. What? Physics. Physics? Yes. I don't want sword. I do want axe. Do you want bow? Do you want authority? Close counter and bow crit. Do I want? No, because I'm going. Uh, I want to gain axe prowess now because I'm going to want to get a class that requires you to have a certain amount of axe ability or class or yes knowledge in using that weapon so that i can become that class and then once i master that class i'll be able to have an ability that's very very strong uh so i want to pick that up as soon as i can realistically time to take some damage you initiate combat with this follow up if possible before one third time around. I mean, honestly, these might be decent. Plus 50 once my battalion's slow enough. <sighs> Do I want plus 10 hit, plus 6, plus 6? Yeah, no. I'm going to want to keep these. Okay. So now... We save and theoretically should do better this time around. I'm sure you're incidentally ready and willing. Stay focused. I will fight him. You have Lady A. Yes, okay. This is definitely more doable. It's not going to be easy, but it's doable. Level two. You know, you can crit any time you want, Claude.
Okay. We have fought off the first wave of enemies. That's the golden deer for you. Jesus Christ. I have to like pull out all of the fucking stops for this shit. Well, this is the first fucking level, so of course it's gonna get harder. <laughs> Crit, 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 crit. Damn it. No crit. I'm big sad. Yes. I had a eighteen ish percent to do that. Yes. Uh crits are kinda like the number they say is a bit bigger than it normally is, if that makes any sense. Yes, if you have a chance to crit, you're more likely to than what the number says. Yes! Easy fucking crit. Cool. That makes all of this a lot easier. Oh, I forgot to equip my bow. Mike is playing Minecraft. Oh my god.
try. My training. Okay. It may took me eighteen turns. Why, thank you so much. Great work, Teach. you have Finally, yeah. Oh, it only took me to basically cheat. It's not cheating, cheating, but it kind of is. It's not exploits per se. It's an intended strategy, but some people may say that this is an illegitimate run because of it. Now that you I have something to ask you. 
Inside the sink. sink. Now that you well done, you have my thanks.
uh, gives me after or the next time that I go to go to explore uh, I can talk to her again and she gives me a bunch of like fruits and seeds and teas and such and so forth the vegetables and fruits can be used to cook better things so that I can increase my stats which I'm gonna do right now chef if I cook with someone and I select one of these things, I can gain various effects for the rest of the month. And this one gives me plus uh, luck, so I'm just going to do this. check with this for now and if I can do any more things. Th this game stressing me out? Yeah. Not really. It's more of just making decisions and making sure that I won't regret the decisions later. doing this for because if I realize that hey I don't really need to do this and I don't really need to do this kind of thing uh, I gotta wait another day before I might as well just burn through all of it that's just eating food here left and right uh, peach sorbet no this one no this one no this one At the point where I'm doing things that don't really matter, but I might as well do them. Because why not? I do want to recruit Ingrid, I think. Do I? I think so. Because there's paralogs that I can do if I recruit certain people before certain deadlines. And if I can do those, then I get better equipment but I just don't know what equipment I'll really need um, clog don't tell me I don't need your help uh, group tasks I'll do sky watch with you and Marianne I guess Custom focus axe bow. Yeah, sure. And then we might as well, if at all possible, lance flying. Might as well just give him flying too. But I think he's gonna get axe. It's axe and flying. Axe, flying. If you're wondering why I'm giving everybody axe and flying and lance and flying, is that um, during paralogs, I have to use the units that are in the paralog uh so that i can get the item but but i'm making it so that 
axe and flying, they'll constantly be growing axe and flying so that if at any point I need them to, Uh, no, they don't, they don't, um, they're good at it, yes, but they can transform into a, a flyer unit, which is a lot, makes it a lot easier to run away from people. So, that's why I'm doing it. Um, paralogue, okay, so prologue means it's before the thing. Epilogue means it's after the thing. Paralog means it's happening alongside it. Yeah. Instruct. And we're only going to really need to instruct Claude, but I might as well buff out other things too while I'm at it. Cool. Lawrence. We can up your flying, I do believe. What? Oh, that's motivation level. So the higher their motivation, like see, because I can't, I, I, you in when instructing you expend their motivation to get them skills, basically. Motivation isn't used for anything but this kind of thing. Um, so I want to increase everybody. What? Oh. I think we're just going to do... Fine. 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 Bravo, I think we can hear people on your end. You're good. forever later on, isn't it? <laughs> oh. What's that? Oh, right. Auto-instruct is a thing. Train area. Of I should have just done that. I'm a fucking idiot. Begin lecture. <laughs> uh, what do you recommend? Read. No, it changes depending on the person. No. Yes, Wyvern and the Pegasus. Um, my guy, the, the the guy with the yellow hair, and he fists people. training um yes yes this guy Okay. 
Can I wait? Hold on. Ooh, I can. Kind of neat. Get like five of these. Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? I'll get one eventually, yeah. Whatever. Thanks a bunch. Come back. I don't think I'm gonna need this. So I'm gonna pack a voluntary and a concoction instead. Iron plus steel bow training axe. Should be fine. Combat parts. Get rid of monster blast for this. Yay, Mooney! Ready and willing. Gamble in, gamble in. Shall we dance? It's not luck, it's faith. Okay, yeah, this is. Kind of stupidly easy. Sweet dreams. With, um. Uh, these guys won't be too high level, actually. These guys will be like... Oh yeah, they're level 3. Jesus Christ, yeah, no, I'm gonna fucking crush them. But hey, it's XP! the XP I can get. Never underestimate an outside. Which I suppose means I should three step back on the sort of thing. gonna break soon not really but maybe that's the golden deer for you hell yeah level C okay that's kind of all I really wanted I think I could I don't want to, but I think I could afford to just skip this over because it's going to be really grindy otherwise. Well, because the main thing is I don't know at what point this is going to become stupid because I know it gets stupid. And there's a few levels where I would want to be over leveled for the simple fact of on certain levels I want to be on as many different places as I can be. Which means that I don't have time to waste killing. So if I can get some semblance of something now it should be better question mark right but i don't know how much it would be versus how much it would just be kind of a 
time sink. But let's do it, whatever. job. Yes, you could have. Store, I'll store this. Rewind time. Uh, let me buy another axe for Mr. Mr. Gamer. Training axe? There it is. Yeah, XP. Also can be renowned, which is really good. Because I can use that to buy better things later. So it is technically it's better, but it's like I don't know, I feel kinda of scummy. What's really dumb about later things is that they start using, um, like, uh, poison touch as one of their skills that they have. Uh, no, after combat, even if they dealt zero damage to you, it'll deal seven damage after combat. So, it... Doesn't it doesn't, but there's skills like that that kind of like do certain things and help you d during certain things. But basically, it's like I don't know, I don't know how to describe it, but that's yes, because the later levels they'll be throwing tons and tons and tons and tons of people at you. Which means that even if you kill them, they're still going to be chipping away at your damage, at your health. And because of that, if they can't kill you with that skill, it'll only ever put you at 1 HP at the lowest. But it just means that if someone can deal 1 damage, you're dead. Yeah. It's stupid. Yeah, it's it's a little stupid. I mean, it makes sense, but it's still stupid. I don't like it. Uh, map. I want to get closer up there. There we go. Save. Do I have enough charges? 28 plus 9 should be fine. Nah, I'm going to buy another one.
Nie, moment, ty... W Pog Buggers. You the Pogus, bro. Alright, so we did all of that that we could because in What the fuck is that emote brand bot? Gag. Or as I say GG, I can't tell. Hexco Burr. The fuck are you putting in my chat, Brambot? <laughs> Everything. Everything. Yeah, makes sense. Bit empty, ain't it? Can't argue with results, can you? Hey man, don't fucking roast me. What is it, Brannis Botulus? Whoa! Hosting stream with one viewer. Thank you, Brambot. Shouldn't get stupid yet. Alright, back to my 57th lost Fortnite round. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, I guess sell. What? I'm guessing so, you're going to be taking a shield for my keyboard. Because now I can do a donut and some shields. What about your. I know, but what about your keyboard would have stopped that?
Mm -hmm. I could do one smoothly now, whereas I would do the same thing on the other keyboard and I wouldn't be able to do it. Do you think your keyboard was dropping inputs if you were doing too many inputs at the same time? Probably. Has it ever done that in the past where you'd be typing too fast or something and then it would drop an input? Like it would skip letters? Yeah. Yeah. Then yeah. Probably couldn't handle more than two buttons being pressed at the same time, which is kind of stupid. <laughs> Low key, high key. Thick, dumb. might just be better in general. Yeah. Uh, the more HP I have, the more I have to worry about not healing to full with it. If that makes any sense. Like, sure, it'll help, but it'll also burn through my resources more. Because percentage-wise, I don't want to be lower than a certain amount. And by adding more HP, that percentage is a, a higher amount, which means I'll be effectively losing more just because of the way I go about things, if that makes any sense. Watch out. Oh, I guess I will need Archer to- Oh, see, there, there, that thing, that bullshit. Poison Strike, I think it's called, right? Poison Strike, yeah. If a unit initiates combat and lands a hit, targeted foe lose up to 20% of max HP after combat. That thing is fucking stupid. Yes. Yes. And if you hit him for 80, he's dead. Any, no matter what happens, if five people in one round are able to hit you with this thing, they'll leave you at one HP. Even if they would normally z deal zero damage to you. Do you see why this is stupid?
its fate. Oh, you probably have Poison Strike too, don't you, you fucking asshole. Yeah, Poison Strike. Oh, you have Pass. So that means that these guys can go through my units without much of any kind of... Yeah. I'm probably going to want to go here and use a Fulinary. It's going to suck, though. Too much. I'm basically hoping that they miss at this point. Yeah. Didn't miss. Because now that guy, that bow guy is going to come down. He's going to... Okay, he hit, which means that I lose my 7 HP. That sucks. That sucks a lot. That sucks a lot. I don't... It, it sucks. It. Oh, and of course I fucking miss. Oh, I think I literally just threw it. All right, there we go. So I'm going to want to gambit. Because these bitches need to die. Okay, level up cool. Miss? Didn't miss. Alright. Sorry, but victory is mine. Miss? Please? Well, he, I can't hit back, so I wanted them to miss. Oh, fuck me, dude. Dude, this sucks. Oh, I'm gonna fall back. Are you ever going to fucking miss? Please! Die!
good try. Don't expect. Never underestimate an outsider. is mine. Yay, crit. Careful. This game? Basically. So I don't know, I think the, the characters are... I know I've been skipping over literally every single ounce of what you could possibly see into their character, but their character development and... and uh, Building is really nice in this game. Uh, it's fun tactically. Um, I don't know. Checks off a lot of boxes for me. Um, let me go here. There's a lot of different things you have to think about when when doing certain things. Not only in combat, but like a pre pre preparing for everything kind of thing. Another thing that's stupid, that's really stupid later about uh, this is uh, a lot of the units will have battalions, and in battalions, it's impossible to counterattack. And they can have, even if they don't do any damage to you, they'll have various effects from dropping your stats or making you unable to move at all, which is stupid. Um. Ready and willing. Piece of cake. Crit, 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 crit. Yeah. That's the golden deer for you. Also, the music really is really good in this game. I like that too. What are you, Axe Boy? Wouldn't you like to know, Weather Boy?
Poison strike, poison strike, everywhere you go, poison strike. And of course you have, like, gigantic fucking speed so that I can't double you, right? God, fucking dickhead. Aha! Uh -huh. It doesn't really matter when they miss on my turn, because... There we go, good. Murder time. It was a good try. Never underestimate an outsider. You? Hmm. Never underestimate an outsider. Ooh, crit, 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 yeah! Dumb bitch. Those thieves ran out your leadership. All right, twenty three turns. All right, I think this is going to be a good point for me to stop streaming. Bye-bye stream.